Fans are currently eagerly awaiting the next season of Outlander, and it's just about to hit our screens. The seventh season of the star's hit drama recently unveiled various images from the set. They seemed pretty wholesome as it showed one of the stars smiling during filming, but it might have also teased the end of the young Ian storyline in the series. There's so much going on in Outlander, so let's get into what might be happening next season. Back in May, we were hit with one of the most devastating cliffhangers from Outlander, as many fans were eagerly awaiting to find out what happened to Claire Frazier and her fate. And it's all because of my selfishness. However, fans still have to wait a decent amount of time to see what was going on, as the production was still continuing in Scotland. Speak with Brianna Randall. Is she at home? No. She went to Scotland. To Scotland? Why? to visit her mother. Despite this, though, fans weren't exactly left out to dry as various behind-the-scenes photos were released of the beloved actor John Bell in costume as his character Young Ian. Stars, are you listening? The people demand it. We need a show of just Young Ian and Rolo hunting and walking and, and, and just being awesome. Get on it. We were super excited to finally see something about the next season of Outlander, as we already know everyone hates being left in the dirt when it comes to a television show. It might be a trend where shows go on hiatus for a year to get filming in and don't really want to show anything, but people love getting small tidbits of information throughout the year. I've dreamt of this day for so long, helping you into your dress, doing your hair. I mean, just think back to your favorite TV show that did this. It really helps you, am I right? I always look back to The Flash with this in mind, as they would always release set photos and there would be leaks throughout the year of filming. With shows like these, there's always something going on in the fandom to keep everyone tied over for the season, to finally drop on our screens. This woman is a liar and a witch. This woman has also been known to drink poison and survive. How do you come to this knowledge? Going over to Twitter, the official Outlander account shared a photo of John Bell who was posed with a huge smile on his face while sitting on a rock. The photo itself seemed harmless, but many people looked at the caption and read very deeply into what might be going on. They tiled John Bell and said that he had a smile that could melt any winter weather away for good. He's the new improved <laughs> version. John um, Bell point look at two. Look this. this. I mean, talk lap. about dedication. Why don't you ever shave your head? Obviously, the actors and showrunners have remained very tight-lipped about young Ian's storyline going forward. Can you give us a little tease? Can you say anything for us? For the Cherokees. Mm -hmm. We'll keep it Cherokee, okay. so, um, so we'll keep it Cherokee. But could this image be a potential teaser to what's in store for the Highlander? I mean, look at what's been going on in the television industry recently, and Outlander itself. We need to trust you as a plan. He's gracious. Merciful. Something might be going on, and it's been under our noses for a decent amount of time. Looking back to Outlander, the last time we saw Ian, he and Jamie were galloping towards the direction of Wilmington in hopes to save Claire. Anyone be coming after you, lad? It's nice he has any vengeful kin. Oh, we'll eat well tonight. <laughs> These two had the dog in them, that's for sure. Running off into uncertainty, God, they are insane. It was a super intense scene and one that we really want to see revisited during the next season. God, we cannot wait. Even just talking about Outlander Season 7 is getting us so extremely hyped up. Where's that? <laughs> oh, I think I'm getting old. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna live dangerously. Dip my toes in the water. I hope you're feeling the same as this video is about to get even bigger. Since he first appeared back in season three of Outlander, young Ian has had a huge thirst for adventure, which has often found him in very difficult situations. You're free to go. Let's take Roger. I'm sorry for what we did to you. He spent a good amount of time living with his uncle Jamie, but Ian decided to exchange places with Roger McKenzie. Hi. who had been captured by the Mohawk tribe. Because of this, he finally managed to develop his survival skills and learn the language that let him love the tribe. He even fell in love during this time, which was just beautiful to see on the screen. I mean, we all love to see an on-screen romance, right? Especially in shows with dire situations. However, after being missing for the majority of the fourth season, Ian returned to the ridge as a heartbroken and destroyed man. Wondering. 
lost. Things clearly didn't go well for him off screen, and it was truly heartbreaking to see it play out. The show then revealed that Ian was told to leave the Mohawk tribe after a number of failed pregnancies. I guess he really didn't have that dog in him after all. The tribe believed that the man's spirit should go into battle with the woman's in order to overcome it, but sadly the Mohawk tribe felt like Ian's spirit wasn't strong enough for a child to take root in the womb. Obviously, that's clearly not how it works. Well, according to modern medicine anyway. But this was truly heartbreaking breaking for those watching the series, and of course Ian himself who just wanted a family. Because of this, the tribe said that he and Emily were no longer compatible and that he had to make his way back to his original family. The series of course continued from there, and Ian finally came face to face with his Mohawk best friend, but was devastated when he learned that he went on to marry Emily in Ian's stead. Is this what you want? It is what must be. Let her speak. This was another truly heartbreaking moment for the character, and you could just see how many bad cards this character had been dealt. I mean, just look at his track record. He's not exactly going to be a happy guy, is he? He suffered so much betrayal and heartbreak in this series, so this smiling photo is really something different. With all of the context in mind, this photo is really weird and could hint at a lot of happier times to come for young Ian. We really hope you get a happy ending if he is to leave the series, or at least his life should take a better turn if he is to continue without London. Because of what happened, happened at the end of Season 6, fans are obviously hoping that Season 7 is going to kick off with a bang. We're hoping for the successful rescue of Claire, but in true Outlander fashion, that's not going to be a straightforward mission, is it? I mean, have you been watching the show? Nothing is straightforward. Perhaps Ian is going to find love once again, as he occasionally voiced admiration for Claire and Jamie's relationship. This man knows what he wants, and either way, fans are going to have to wait a while for Season 7 to see what's in store for Ian and the other characters. We're really hoping hoping he finds love in the next season, or at least finds a new purpose to drive him forward to become a better man. The story itself is probably going to keep him back though, as in true Outlander fashion, nothing is going to go to plan. In terms of a release date for season 7, there is currently a decent amount to unpack at the moment. Where in the world do we start with all of this? We don't actually know our release date right now, but we should be getting some sort of announcement this winter. Before the end of February, we should get something in terms of a release date. We already know this as it was revealed that the first batch of episodes should be kicking off sometime this summer. But damn, that really is a broad window of time, isn't it? It could literally be anywhere from June to September. That's just insane to think of. We really hope we get a release date soon, as going forward in the next few months, we should be learning more information on Season 7. Let's just hope the trailer hasn't spoiled the full thing. Am I right, guys? What did you think about today's video? Let us know in the comments section below.